So what is going on guys? Welcome to the YouTube channel. If we have not yet met, my name is Peter Roberts. Now, recently I've decided that I wanna incorporate more lawn care content into my YouTube channel. I wanna help you guys grow your lawn care business, explain my journey as an entrepreneur growing my first lawn care business. And right now we just got off the phone like a little second ago um, with someone who was interested in starting their lawn and landscaping business. And I wanna tackle a very important question that he answered me. Like this guy had the thoughts, I wanna have this side hustle, make some extra cash in my life. Like I don't really like my job but on the weekends i want to go out and mow lawns and make some extra money now this might be you as well this was me when i first started my business going from zero to over 60 customers in two years i've learned a very important lesson about competition now one of the biggest fears that you might have jumping into the lawn care industry if you want to start making money if you see other people are getting their property service you're going to think how am i going to tackle or get into this industry how can i even make a hundred my first forty dollars cutting lawns when i know know that it's probably late in the season that other people have real businesses how do they do it like how can i jump into there when i feel like that market is so saturated and what i told this individual who's very um very optimistic he's excited to get started on his lawn care journey and you might as well and i told him the first thing you want to do is not worry about competition secondly if someone else did it well this is a reason for you to do it because if someone else did it then this gives you clear clarity this gives you justification that you can do it as well and third guys that there is enough and there's abundance out there in this world what you need to do is change your mindset if you want to start any type of business a service business lawn mowing landscaping power washing understand that there is enough money out there literally guys it depends on your focus and efforts in order for you to go out there and actually find these customers customers make money off your service so shift your mindset have that abundance mindset don't let fear don't let all these objections come into you not starting this business now when i first started my lawn and landscaping business i had this fear come right in my face i told my dad hey dad i'm starting this lawn and landscaping business you mind if i can use your truck do you mind if i use your equipment like i just want to start this business i'm tired of my job i want to start making cash on my own terms just please give me a shot and the first thing that he said naturally a pessimistic dude he told me that there's too much competition there's no way that you can do it so as i was slowly building getting more customers i kept on looking at him i was like oh really there's too much competition out there are you serious i can't make money and slowly but surely guys i decided to get one customer two customers three customers four customers and i continue to grow this lawn care journey all from just one customer so what I want to do is help you give some practical advice. If you think that the competition is going to be oversaturated, that your market, that there's no way that you can jump into this industry, what I want to say is literally all you need is one customer. One customer, your first customer that you're going to get on Facebook, the first customer that you're going to get on the Nextdoor app, the first customer that you get a referral from your friend, the first customer that you get from knocking on doors up the street, this is a business. The first customer you get is your business because word of mouth is one of the greatest ways that you'll see is going to spread your business. Now, one thing that he mentioned here at the end of the call was like, how can I separate myself from the competition? Peter, what have you done? And now, honestly, guys, other than maybe one or two people, from the moment I started my lawn care business till today, I've had the same customer base. Customers continue to show up every week to pay me. Customers continue to go with my business. Customers don't quit on me. Customers call me back for more referrals. Customers call me back for more business. And I didn't have any customers at first. Why is this so? How do I separate myself from competition? And I share with them quickly about a story that happened yesterday. One of my new customers that I got yesterday, all from word of mouth, um, she actually gave me the key to her house. She gave me the key to go into her house. She wants me to paint. She wants me to have my guys do all this stuff inside. And she says, whenever you need anything, here is the key to my house. And I said, I've met you once. I'm thinking to myself, I've met you once and you're giving me a key to your house because if people can develop trust in you, the reason that you're gonna separate yourself yourself your business from someone else is their ability to trust you their ability to have or feel like you're gonna be reliable their ability for you to be there for them all the time like you not bailing on them guys if you can make a commitment to your customer first off they won't care how much it's gonna cost for their service second off they'll continue to call you back and third off you will not be shaken with your business your business will grow. The competition will have nothing on you because they have no competitive edge over you. And lastly, you can charge and raise your prices very easily when customers trust you, feel like you're reliable, and know that you're going to do a great service. So use your service, guys. Everything is considered a commodity. They can have me cut their grass or they can have someone else cut their grass. But what makes me different is the value that is given within my service. Now, the value comes from my personality. The value comes from my uh, communication skills. The value comes from going out there, talking to the customers. The value comes 
comes from following up, hitting them up after I service their property. The little, little, little nuances provide more value in my service that separate me, the commodity, the guy that does the same service that someone else does down the street and allows me to cash flow, make money, and crush my competition. So if you have any concerns about competition or wondering what's the deal with this whole competition thing, just know that you can get started and you can crush it and make money in lawn care. So one thing that the guy ended the phone call with is that he booked a phone call. So if you guys wanna book a phone call with me in my bio, um, yes, I was doing free phone calls, but I kinda wanna bring more value to you guys to a 30 minute phone call. Um, I hate to monetize my audience, but I think this is the best way that I can actually take you guys serious as I'm growing my business. Um, I just wanna give you guys in, in, in I guess an in step-by-step -step plan on what you can do to take action with wherever you are in your lawn care business. If you want to make some extra money, um, let's hop on a phone call. I just want to build a community of people that want to help grow, start their side hustle, make money mowing lawns. A great way, guys. One of the best ways. If you have a phone call for me, 40 bucks, I will guarantee you'll make this $40 by getting your first customer within two days. Uh, if you don't get your first customer, then uh, just hit me up and I'll, I'll just send the money back. Not that I want money, but I just want to share with you guys that you have to kind of take a fin financial risk. One of the best things that I did when I started my business was I invested in a course. I invested in equipment. I invested, I invested, invested. And then fruitfully, I was able to get paid. So take the initiative to let go a little bit of, of that grip on money. Use it as a vehicle to start your business. And then more importantly, I want to connect with amazing people that are following, tuning into my channel. So we got long care. We got investing. We got my life. We got a lot of videos going on this channel, guys. But this is me. This is Peter Roberts. We are at the gym right now. We are doing our 75 hard challenge right now. So we're going through a lot of different things. But I just want to say I love you guys so much. Thank you for tuning in. I hope this video brought you a little bit of value. Um, leave that thumbs up if it did. Leave that thumbs down if this was absolutely horrendous. Um, and more importantly, help subscribe by growing this channel. Love you guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers.